All right, ready? Yeah. Okay, number 15 is Hedera Helix in the Aureliaceae. And um, this is another invasive plant. Um, it's been in California for over 100 years. Um, brought um, as an ornamental plant and uh, to help in landscaping. It's a, you can see here, it's a very effective ground cover. Um, and it will scramble along the ground and it will also climb up on top of things like this chain link fence here. Um, and oftentimes you see it uh, climbing up trees as well. You can see, um, what are those trees? Um, covered with English ivy. This is, um, so Wait, again. this is considered a liana. It's a woody vine and it has alternate leaves. And these leaves are very distinctive. Okay, they have a chordate base, heart-shaped base. They have a very leathery, plasticky texture. And they have a very strong odor. Smells a little bit like carrots. Um, and carrots, um, I can't remember if that, does APAC still exist? It does? Okay, well APAC, the carrot family, is sister family to the Aureliaceae. Um, this plant is found um, generally uh, in any kind of wooded area, um, any disturbed area near towns and cities, um, especially along the California coast. It's uh, considered very highly invasive and um, it's also uh, a, special, a species of concern because it's so good at crowding out um, other plants, uh, native plants. As you can see, it just forms these very dense carpets and it makes it very difficult for um, other plants to grow. And in fact, on campus, uh, there are, I, I see every year there's groups of student volunteers that uh, always are in Strawberry Creek pulling out uh, Hedera helix um, and putting it in bags and taking it to the compost. So to sum up, um, this is a liana. It's got a woody stem with alternate leaves. They're evergreen. They're shiny and plasticky with a heart-shaped base and a pointed tip. And if you still aren't sure about uh, what it is, crush it and smell the carrot-like odor. You're such a cutie.